So for today, we're going to be looking at what 801 is offering. We're going to be looking at the shaders and then the armor. So that way we, I, we can get an idea of what she's selling. So if you guys like the video, like, comment, subscribe. Let's just get into it. So for the first shader, it's going to be Vitrified Chronology. This is from Season of Dawn. So it is a while ago. Looks pretty cool. Um, I like the purple glow. I'm not a fan of the brown, but I think this is a much better shader. So definitely pick this one up if you want. Mercury Prophetic. I don't know this one. Uh, it's okay. I, I've definitely seen better shaders out there, but it's not bad. I don't think it's trash by any means. And then a uh, new monarchy regalia. Unfortunately, I would have loved if they have offered the other new monarchy shader that we're missing. Cause I think we're missing only one more that she hasn't sold yet, but this is still such a banger of a shader that I would definitely recommend people to pick this one up just because it's so amazing. So as for the armor, it's going to be the tangled stuff. It's basically the fallen themed stuff. I definitely think the hunter has the best set. The warlocks have the second best set. And then the Titans, I think so many pieces are cool it's just hard to combine with a lot of pieces i'm not going to speak too much upon this because i have reviewed this one already as an ada has already sold this one but i think the hunter i think the helmet is pretty cool the cloak is definitely cool it just you're, you're gonna have some trouble with it because it it colors really really bad um mostly because it has a discoloration that does apply to shaders as well at least certain shaders the boots the helm or the boots the chest and I think the boost in the chest are probably the only ones that I, I would say are not that great because I think the arms are super cool. It's just the fact that one side is smaller compared to the other. So it's going to be weird when you combine it with other armor sets or the Titan. I think the helmet is super cool. I think actually uh, the chest piece is really cool as well, but the arms and then the boots and the, the mark, I think are just lacking uh, for the warlocks. The helmet is interesting. I like it a lot. The boots are super cool and the arms are super cool. Granted, they are kind of basic, but I still think they're really cool. And then the chest piece is super cool as well. So, oh, and the bond, let me, the bond is super fucking cool. It's just very unfortunate that the like orange glows uh, on the side don't change color. Other than that, I think all the pieces are really cool. Uh, the ones that I mentioned that at least. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, nothing too much to discuss. It's just, uh, I don't know. I, I like I like the shaders that she's giving out this week. I mean, to be fair, I would love it if it was actual shaders that I needed because as you guys can see, it's already blocked out, but it is what it is. Hopefully she gives, gives us some more shaders from the past, specifically the new monarchy stuff, just because unfortunately, and I just was not thinking, but when Warmind release, that's the time when you can only choose, was it two? You can only choose... Well, no, you can choose more than one faction, but at the time when I got there, it was two weeks left in the DLC until Forsaken came out. And like an idiot, I chose a uh, future war or yeah, I chose future war cult instead of new monarchy, which is like my biggest shame because uh new monarchy has the best shaders future war cult. I only got them because at the time they were selling, not selling, well, they were offering this right here. Not for the, not for the, um, this is gaze beyond stars. This is an ornament that the factions gave to the warlocks, specifically, um, the edgy boys. I forget their name. Um, yeah, I forget, I forget their, their actual name. The, uh, oh, the edge boys, not new monarchy or future war called the other boys. Uh, the hunters got this one, which in hindsight, I should not have gone for this one. Future war called gave them this one. And I just. I question my thought, my, my, like, it's, it's so dumb. I should not have gone for this. Cause it's just basically a recolor compared to the ones that Titans got, which was, uh, a really cool, um, crest of alpha loopy ornament. It's just, it's very unfortunate, but yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I appreciate you guys coming up to this point. This video should be out sooner than last week. Cause I'm home. I'm currently making these videos. So hopefully these videos come out either today or tomorrow, most likely to, to tomorrow for this video, but today for the uh, challenge videos. So let me know what you guys think. I appreciate you guys coming up to this point. Be safe and I will see you guys later.